Son, you did it. You did it, son. My son, he's a sixth grader. If y'all did not know, my son had um struggled in school when he was younger. He was held back two grades. And in one school, they weren't able to help him because the class setting was too big. But when I brought him to Tyler Town, they saw differently. They was more hands-on. And I think every teacher that was ever involved with my child while he was at Tyler Town Elementary School, everybody who was hands-on with him, I thank you. All the way down from the principal, Miss Felicia Prince. We thank you so much. Where can I express how much I appreciate you and what all you done? And so, so to his teacher, Miss Prime. Miss Jennifer, I thank you so much. We had our talks on different stuff. And hey, I thank God for sending you in our life. It makes a big difference. It makes it a better place that you was able, able to be more hands-on. Able to be more hands-on with my son. Other schools didn't want to take the opportunity to be hands-on with them. Thing is, my son is moving on up today. And I don't know how to really feel about it because it's a proud moment. But what made me more proud about what I was telling y'all is that my son is moving up. Yeah, he could be going to seventh grade, but he's going to the ninth grade. They gave him the chance to get back in his right grade because he was doing very well. And it was an opportunity for him because they didn't want him to feel like he was left out. And I thank God for that opportunity. And for my son to sit here and achieve all eight on a row. Come on, y'all got to look at this. Please get, give my son a shout out. What that was in? Oh, just eight on a row for that. for good behavior. Honor and math. Science. Student of the month. That's awesome. Man, how many awards you got? 10. 12. 12 awards for math. Honor all A's. Another all A's. Citizenship. I mean, I'm telling y'all, man, it's such a blessing. Certificate, excellent. He don't realize how important the small stuff is, but it's very important. And then they gave him, man, look at all the little on the road medals. It's a blessing. It is a blessing. Sometimes where we feel like we last, God will put you in a position where he'll make you first. And I thank God for everything he done my, for my son and what he's continuing to do for my family. And I just say, son, I'm very proud of you. You a young man going to high school. You're skipping seven, eight grade. You're going straight to high school. So now you are more one step closer to graduating to being grown, being on your own. Which you ain't gotta leave if you don't want to, but time is waiting for nobody. But I just wanna tell you, man, I love you and I'm very proud of you for your accomplishment. I never received those. Like, real talk, I, I didn't get them type of grades when I was your age. And for you to bounce back like the way that you're doing and you getting back to where you need to be, that's a blessing. Papa proud of you. Mama proud of you. Mom and dad proud of you. Your brother proud of you. And now you got a baby sister who's proud of you. And anyway, I just want you to continue to pray to God on everything that you want. Ask him in his will. And he'll make it happen. Good morning, guys. He'll make it happen for you, son. Just got to keep him first. Whatever that God put on your heart to do do it and if you ever feel like you're not happy with something or you're afraid to talk to somebody talk to me or talk to your mom listen we're here for you we don't ever want you to feel like it, it's nothing that you can't kill us i promise you that if you can't talk to me talk to now talk to papa we are here for you we love you 
And I just want you to know that, man. And um, keep God first. Oh, and then he's going to be in band, you guys. Band, high school band, playing the drums. I can't wait to get my video camera out for that one. You're going to be like Auntie Gina and Papa. Huh? Keep the music thing going in the family. But y'all, please give my son a shout out and tell him congratulations on this opportunity where he's moving. He jumped up two more grades to get put back on track where he needed to be. And he got the opportunity to correct in his life. And I'm so proud of it because I was in school. I made my mistakes and it cost me. And I had to work twice as hard to get back what I lost. But I made it, I fixed my problem. I thank God for that. I don't take nothing for granted that way. And I'm just so happy to be able to see my son get an opportunity to get on the right track and do right. Thank y'all for watching. Proud of you, man. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. And you were small. You didn't know your mom. Your mom and me when you was a baby. And it was me by myself that you failed. I didn't know how. They didn't give me an instruction manual on how to be a father. They didn't. I did the best I could with you. Some days I come off and work, I be too tired. Then we won't play video games. I just mentally see where you were at. And I do apologize. But as a father, I do love you. And I wish with you on this journey when you go to high school. Just everything that you ever done. She I always do that. But I want to continue to be there and continue to push you to be better than I ever could. You know why? For one, you got my name. You're going to do better than me. You got to. Two, I want to do for you. I don't want you to have to do the things that I have to do. Take the bad jobs that I have to do. I want God to give you whatever in your heart that you desire. I want Him to grant you. And I don't want you to have to kiss nobody, but life ain't gonna be easy. It's never easy. But if you know who you are, you stay true to who you are, God always gonna make a way for you. And guess what? He is here and I already started that way for you right now. You see how I got my walkway production business? I do filming. That's something I want to do. Not saying you gotta do it, but I want you to see me do it. So they can inspire you say, hey, if my daddy can be a uh, videographer, I can be a basketball player. I can be that track player, track star player. I can be a football player. I can be a, anything I want to be, an actor, or the president. Whatever that you want to do, stay true to what you want to do, and don't let nobody talk you out of it, including me. But I can't tell you what you can do with it and can't do with it. Only you can fulfill that. You hear me? You gonna do right? You gonna do it? Yeah. You gonna prove me wrong? Cause you can do whatever you wanna do. Yeah. But I believe in you. Believe in you. Instead of fighting, that you wanna fight. You wanna fight me? Wanna fight? <laughs> <laughs> you ain't ready.